The other day in my intro to criminal justice class, a student took out a whole lemon and started to peel it. And then he asked me for the time. So I told him and he went, oh, okay. In a sad tone of voice and put his partially peeled lemon back in. (laughs) He put his his partially peeled lemon back into his bag, almost ashamed of his actions. (laughs) My question is this. (laughs) <laughs> what should I do if this situation comes up again? What is the code word that I can use so I can get this man to enjoy his lemon in class? I think he's some kind of citrus sleeper agent, and I need advice. And that's confused and citrus on court. <laughs> this is... <clears throat> we have been getting... Listen, before we talk about this, I just want to say, we have been getting some fucking all-time oh, no questions jo- yeah, from the last, like The past months. few weeks yeah. have been all-time questions and i can't thank you enough for making this show palatable there's Um, so many there's so many i love our listeners and i believe i listen i believe you if you come to us with a question that that is a sacred bond of trust you put forward i believe you except i don't believe this person because there's so many there's so many angles to this dangle that is just unimaginable the fact that this person is apparently going to eat a lemon is like not even chief among them but that they un unpeeled they unspooled this lemon a little bit found out that the time was bad or wrong and then put the partially unpeeled just gonna let some of the raw flesh of the fruit touch the inside of my jan sport what (laughs) this this kind of thing always makes me feel i'm an old man now i'm 33 i'm not as hip as i used to be this always makes me fear like that this is a reference or a meme or some kind of internet joke that yes. was like a setup that like you were supposed to respond a certain way and like what's the fox say and you're like this is math class what are you talking about, what are you talking uh, about? okay this is a ga- uh, this right. was a gag from last night's american dad well he didn't fucking see that of course <laughs> oh i've got it <laughs> Start so you're saying that the, you're person? saying that after they asked for what time, you should have looked at them in the eyes and said, "What? Yeah, exactly. Like, exactly. That's Here's exactly what you do. It. Here's what I think the proper response is in this situation. They start peeling the lemon. They say, "Excuse me, do you have the time?" You do a dramatic take, make eye contact with them, and whisper, "It's the sour hour," and then just everything <laughs> goes crazy. <laughs> I mean, I I think you could even be more on the nose than that and just say, it's time for me to watch you apparently eat a lemon <laughs> like one like one might eat a delicious tangelo, and I'm very much looking forward to it. So please <laughs> don't 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 cock block me again. I gotta watch this pop off, please. I've been thinking about it all week since you bailed on me last week. You left me devastated. I do enjoy the image of a person who attends their class with a lemon and not a phone. So they have the one thing, they do have a lemon with them. They left the house today with a lemon and not a phone. Yeah.